Hamlin created an online fundraiser to provide toys to children in need. The Washington Commanders donated $5,000 to that fundraiser. Our sports reporter Charlotte McBride is live at the team's practice facility in Ashburn and Charlotte. Clearly a lot of people are trying to show their support for Hamlin in any way possible. Yeah, Lorenzo, absolutely. For everyone that knows Jamar Hamlin, the first thing they'll tell you is he's much more than just a football player. For him, his community means everything, and that toy drive meant a lot to Jamar Hamlin. When he set it up, his initial goal on GoFundMe was to raise $2,500. Since Monday night, that toy drive has raised $6.6 million with the Washington Commanders donating 5000 as you just mentioned. Well, today here at the Commanders facilities in Ashburn, we had a chance to talk with Commanders players about what happened to DeMar Hamlin. Many of them at home with their families watching this all unfold on national TV Monday night. Like all of us, it was horrifying for them to see many of them incredibly emotional. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I had to, I was fighting tears back, um, you know, just you know, especially, you know, there's there's guys that you that you may know on the team, you know, all of us in here, we, we've been playing this game a long time. We love this game. And, uh, you know, a lot of us, we also say that this game isn't worth anyone's, anyone's life. My first thought was just to start praying for him. Like, I'm a big believer in prayer and God heals and changes situations. And when you see stuff like that, it, it shakes everyone to your core. Um, but um, from everything that I've heard about DeMar, he's a resilient man. Um, he has an unbelievable amount of support. He's just a stand-up guy, you know what I mean? He's, he's, he's everything a kid should want to be, you know what I mean? He's a role model. He's, uh, he's everything you could think of, you know what I mean? Me and him always do a camp every year, and a couple other guys, we do a football camp in Pittsburgh, and, you know, just being with him, working with him, doing stuff like that is just a, a true blessing, and it's a blessing there to call him a friend. And you just heard Khalid Hudson talking about him, calling him a friend. They are friends. They grew up together just outside Pittsburgh. And you heard him talking about they do a camp together every year. And he was the one telling us how much the community really means to Damar Hamlin and how special it is to see the toy drive, something that meant so much to him raised so much money in just the last 48 hours alone. Again, $6.6 million, people just showing their support. Terry McLaurin also telling me that it shows what this NFL community is all about. Everyone here to support everyone and all of them offering their prayers to DeMar Hamlin tonight. Yeah, they're all deeply affected by this. And nice to show that a lot of folks still showing that love for Hamlin tonight. Absolutely. And clearly, everybody has been so moved by mm -hmm. his life and his impact and they mm -hmm. are helping to continue that yeah. even as he tries to rebuild all, all right, right. thank you